Hi everybody, welcome to World Swamp. Tonight I thought I would talk about torches in Ark Survival Evolved. Here on the center map it doesn't get real pitch black. On the old uh, regular island map it does get very dark, but still it's nice to have a torch and a torch this hand torch that i have is pretty much the first thing that you can craft in arc survival evolved let's just take a quick look at what it takes to craft one right there it is extremely simple one of the easiest things to craft you only need one wood one flint and one stone no big deal uh you can attack things with a torch and you can also give it a toss which is kind of nice to light up areas of caves and that sort of thing. The next thing that you can light up your work area with is the standing torch, which is right here. The standing torch is going to require fuel, and let's take a look at what it takes to build one of those. So, a standing torch right here is eight thatch, one flint, one stone, and three wood. Also very easy to craft. And you can place those out here on the ground. You can place them on foundations or whatever. And you can fuel them. Let's get the, whoops, get the, uh, access the inventory here. You can fuel them with wood, which is going to burn a lot longer. You can fuel them with spark powder. And you can fuel them with thatch. Did I say that already? And thatch is going to be it's going to burn faster but it won't produce charcoal so it's nice to kind of burn wood if you need a source of charcoal but it does burn very slowly and produces wood very slowly so let's put out the fire and the other thing that you can use is angler gel and angler gel produces this weird glowy light let's uh run over here and i didn't notice i'm starving to death let's eat a bunch of berries real quick and it yeah it produces this weird glowy gel and if you um like put one of these on a platform saddle on a plesiosaur and light it before you go in the water it will stay lit actually um when you go underwater which is kind of cool and there's the torch so that's those two there's another torch though uh let me grab get rid of this inventory because i am burdened run over here and we'll put this wood back in here and i'm going to take this angler gel out and then we'll put it back of the regular old fire fires look really cool too that little uh, hand torch there is uh still burning bright the other thing that you can build is a wall torch which i think are kind of uh really cool looking you have to build those in the smithy so let's look that one up you're going to need four thatch, one flint, one stone, two wood, one metal ingot, and one cementing paste. Also very easy to craft. We'll craft one of those up. And of course, the standing torch, you're going to have to put, or excuse me, the uh, wall torch, you're going to have to put on a wall. So let's use that item. All right. So when you place it, you're going to have to be relatively close to it. And again, you can use any of those other things that I mentioned to light one up or you can use uh, the angler gel in this case I'm gonna put that out um, torches produce not a whole lot of light like I said it doesn't get real dark here it is becoming dawn over here at the farm but uh, these uh, other lights electric lights are much much brighter so let's go over to the greenhouse and we'll fire one of these up so there's just one light here and it lights up a huge area and i've got another one in the greenhouse um, it's a much more economical to run one of these after you've built a generator the standing lights uh or excuse me these are omnidirectional lights they don't really cost much to build uh, electricity is really uh, easy and efficient to produce i made a bunch of gasoline a long time ago and i still haven't run out and uh it doesn't like unlike in real life it doesn't matter how many things electric uh, hookups you have here it does uses uh, the same amount of gasoline in the generator so that's uh, a quick look at torches and lighting in general i'll pick this guy up we'll use it and so there you go i hope you enjoyed the video if you have please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and thank you for watching